with Rukshi. And today you are going to learn about idioms. Hmm, idioms. Munadami idioms kiyanne? What are idioms? Now in Sinhalese, we call idioms rudi. What is special about idioms? Idioms will make your language interesting. Let me show that with an example. Now, idioms will have a literal meaning and a figurative meaning. Literal meaning is what an idiom exactly says. Figurative meaning is the meaning behind the idiom. Let's take a famous idiom. Every dark cloud has a silver lining. Singhale mukadame rudia. Hama anduru alavakama ridi irak pena tiyanwa. Right. Now the literal meaning is what is meant by the words. The, the literal meaning. The exact meaning of the words is kalu alava tiyanwa ridi irak pena tiyanwa. Figurative meaning is in every bad situation you'll find something positive a reason to smile something good about it now the second idiom for the day running around like a headless chicken now it's sad to say that when you chop off a chicken's head still for a few seconds this chicken or this hen will run with pain. That is the literal meaning. What is the figurative meaning? Hmm. Dekala the yana madha samahara minisu office ke vinna puluwaan, gedara vinna puluwaan. Ekka paara vada goda karana vaya hitu duwana maa, me hitu duwana maa. Antimara vada akvelat ne kisi pili vada kutne. Some people just run around doing nothing or sometimes doing a lot of things in a very disorganized way. So for them, you can say they are running around like a headless chicken. Hmm. Next time, if you see your friend running here and there in a disorganized way, doing nothing or doing so many things hmm. my friend why are you running around like a headless chicken just sit relax and do your work 